Tantri this evening is graduate from Department of Computer Science. Dr. Sheikh directs the Facebook Realty Lab in Pittsburgh. The lab is devoted to achieving photorealistic social interaction in augmented reality and virtual reality. Dr. Sheikh is a consultant professor at Robotics Institute, Carnegie Mellon University, where he directs the perceptual computing lab producing open pose in Panoptic Studio. His research broadly focuses on machine perception and rendering of social behavior spanning sub-disciplines in computer vision, computer graphics, and machine learning. He is an associate editor of IEEE PEMI and has regularly served as a senior program committee member for SIGGRAPH, CVPR, and ICC, three most prestigious conferences. Yasir's research, research has been featured by various news and media outlets, including the New York Times, BBC, CBS, Wired, and The Verge. With colleagues and students, he has won Honda Initiation Award, Popular Science Based of Awards New Award, as well as several conference best paper awards and demo awards. So Yasser was my PhD student from 2001 to 2006. First thing I did, I took him to Hawaii to attend a conference in 2001. And this was his first year with me. And even though he did not have a paper, so just to incite him into research. Then I took him to Korea in 2004, where he did have a paper. But the funny thing about that trip was he left his passport at the local airport where the conference was, Jeju Island, and then he was stranded in Seoul for several days to wait for his new passport. So we used to tease him about this. In 2005, he had two papers in ICCV in Beijing. I took him to the Great Wall of China there, so that was very, very fun to be there. As you heard, he has done very well. I tell my students that other researchers and community will always call you as Mubarak's student, unless you establish yourself as a researcher. This happened in 2018 for Yasser, when he got the Best Student Paper Award at CVPR with his student. In fact, that year, both of Best Paper Award went to my former students. So I was telling Berkeley professor Jatendra Malik about these two awards. Since the second award went to my student, Amir, who was his postdoc. So he knew about it, about him, but I told him about Yasser and he didn't know about Yasser. He didn't know Yasser was my student. Then I said, well, Yasser has made it. Let me end with a quote from President Biden. A father knows he's a success when he turns and looks at his son or daughter and know what they have turned out to better than he did. So even though this is for the biological son and daughter, but I think this can also be true for academic son and daughter. So I'm very proud of Yasser. Tonight we recognize Dr. Sheikh for his exceptional professional achievement and industry contribution. So cheers, cheers Yasser. Thank you very much for the kind words, um, um, Professor Shah. To me, the real measure and metric of the success of an institution, of a lab, of a mentor, is you know how much of a difference did they make in the lives or the trajectories of the careers of the people who uh, they engage with. That's the real measure of it. And it's, it's for this reason why uh, I hold in such high esteem uh, UCF, uh, the, the college, um, uh, Professor Shah's lab and Professor Shah himself. Um, and, you know, the, the change that happened in my life professionally and personally was at UCF. More than any other place in my career, that's the, that took the, 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 the sharp turn in my life. Uh, it takes, as I've learned with my own PhD students, uh, an incredible amount of patience, an incredible amount of faith, uh, time and energy to really make so any sort of a change in the trajectory of, of a person's life uh, and in terms of where they're going. And, and that was my experience. And that to me is the real measure uh, of the quality and of the experience that UCF provides uh, that I experienced at the lab with, uh, with Mubarak and uh, through my interactions with them as well. And 
I have always held uh, Mubarak as the as the mark for myself and how much of a change I make in my own students' uh, lives and now folks in my lab. And it's uh, I found myself always falling short. I, I don't think anybody will make as much of a difference uh, in my life as Mubarak did, as I had experienced at UCF. Um, and I will always be grateful for that. So thank you all for the award and thank you Mubarak for the mentorship and now for the friendship um, uh, and the change that you made in my life. Thank you.